Like I'm kind of detached from the music world and I really don't know like what kind of influence I am to other people. When I'm here at the house, you just Justin. You know, you don't really know who the fuck, you're just a regular ass dude. Then you go. It's like damn, it's real. CEO of Funk Volume. This is the tour which everybody's going out, so I will be headlining it. Sears will be there. Jaren will be there. Lizzy will be there. DJ Hopper will be with us. Check it. 44 cities in the US. Shows are crazy. They all been sold out shows. Last year when we came out here, man, there was only like 50 people in shows. A thousand shows worth of hundreds of artists. That was the best live rap show I've ever seen. Yeah, I'm just trying to get through this tour too, man. I'm just living day by day at the moment. That's the stage dive bruise right there. My whole foot right here. This is swollen. I'm sick on the tour. I'm so fucked up. I've been sleeping like hell, nigga. My dad got it, nigga. Or my mama, nigga. I just dropped four blunts. That was all the fucking weed, yo. Don't move. Don't move, bro. I knew the formula the whole time, but they didn't want to listen. I started getting smarter and smarter and realized that I never needed a record deal in the first place. I had everything I needed. You can get anything at the click of a button. Yeah. yeah. Anything you want, you can get a better record at the click of a button. Yeah. Yeah. You got to be the one they're waiting for. That is fucking luck. I'm taking the piss right now. I see Swiss right here. I'm a provider now. I'm paying for daycare. You know, I'm a daddy. So when I'm on the road, it's like, this is my job. Water bills, rent, gas bills. This is my job, this is my dream. It's another day out here in Rochester, New York. I come from the motherfucking gutter, nigga. I see people struggle for us to be fucking living our lives, doing this shit. You grow up and you do what you love to do, no matter what you are. Ain't nobody want to go back to that type of shit like that, man. Not me. The cold style, make the fucking winter pour. My shit is pure. The kids endure. The shit I'm spitting because it's real life. And through my vision and my stories, you know what it feels like. This time next year, man, it ain't gonna be $20 to see Hobbs. I know our place. I know where we stand. I know our lane. <laughs> We're not in the Rolling Stone lane. Yeah. We are not there yet. Taking this independent living shit to the next level. These days, listen to the artist, fuck a publicist. I'm doing good. Promote your own shit. You don't need these motherfuckers. But you gotta do more. You can't just be dope. You have to be dope and hustle for this shit. Without a major hope. You can be the dopest artist ever. If you don't hustle yourself, no one will ever hear you. All right, all right, all right. And then people say, well, that's industry standard. It's like, fuck that. We are the new industry now. Hey, how do people feel? We on fucking Facebook and YouTube banging on niggas, say, blowing up. I mean, we and Dane didn't actually talk like that to each other. Shake my hand, man! He's right here. He's right there.